should drop in. What is going on, everyone? Welcome back to Occupy Mars. We are continuing where we left off in the last one. So, what we're actually going to do today is we're actually going to sort out our inventory problem we have currently. Um, after the auto save has gone through, there we go. Uh, we're going to pop our helmet back on to conserve oxygen. Our rover. Um, we're going to head outside. Um, we're going to head back to our fob though today, as well. Um, but first things first, we're going to go sort out our inventory problem we're having. We're actually going to fill up the back of this. We've actually got that many materials on us. We need to sort this stuff out. So I'm thinking have a row for each one of the materials. Um, so we're going to start off with small pipes first. But then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to split the stack um, a few times. Uh, just until we've got pretty much the majority of all of this build up. Uh, I think we'll leave it as that for now, but I should be able to just like double click in here now and uh, drop them all off um, fairly nicely. Um, you know what? I'm actually going to do it for all of them. Just because I, I really want to organize it this way. And then it'll just be easy to just double click and drop from there on out. We're going to sort this out like right now. I think, yeah, time's, time's ticking as well for this day. So we should be good. Oh, there's 15. Uh, just do one and then do one. There we go. Right, so we should be able to fill that up. Right, next one's going to be um, probably packs of screws. Um, so... Let me just do one, one. I should really probably do most of this off camera, but we're just going to do it here and then it should be good. This one might end up becoming our bulk storage tank because I'm not going to probably do this again unless if I do it off camera for um, main base. Well, to be honest with you, I'm only really doing this for ease of just like click shift clicking into here. Um, solar cells can come next, right? Okay, so we can shift click those into there. Um, we'll do small engines next, which we're not going to have many of those, so we'll just pop those in there like that. Um, solar cells can go next, and uh, then we'll do glass plates, which we're not going to have many of those. Steel plates can go next. Aluminium plates we haven't done yet, so aluminium can go in next. Uh, steel plates. There we go. Aluminium plates. Now what are these? They're solar cells. They're solar cells, right? Yep. Uh, electronics can go down here glass plates we've already got which are there right so there you go so our tank is starting to get full we've got enough resources there for now right so i've sorted that out a bit i'm, I'm quite happy with that to be fair right let's uh, head back to the fob we're goodish on food i think i've got some rations in here as well if i need them uh, we're gonna go fill up the tanks and everything we're gonna recharge and everything today um, so what we'll do is we'll take our helmet off just so we use the oxygen in here and then not waste an hour on board oxygen. That's our, our emergency reserves right now. Right. Uh, actually, one other thing before we leave. Is this is this little base now off the map entirely? Oh, no, it's still there. I can see quite, oh, I can't actually see home, can I? We're too far away. Oh, no, can we? Can we actually see home from here? No, we can't. There's also a question mark still there. But yeah, we can't actually see home. Right, let's head back to the fob. I thought we would be able to with uh, with the antennas, but maybe it's not. Yeah, we'll head back to our fob. We'll um, we're gonna recharge ourselves. We're gonna oh, hey, okay. That was fun. I wish I got that in third person. Yeah.
But yeah, we can practically take this thing anywhere, really. And not worry about it too much. But yeah, um, what we'll end up having to do is... I think we're going to have to end up having a mining rover. That mining rover is probably going to get upgraded eventually because we're going to have to start going further and further out to get resources as we start clearing away from home and getting further and further out. But I think for now we're okay. Well, I'm still going to make that mining rover anyway. We might have to make like a, a base away from home where we can crush rocks and stuff like that. Maybe set up like a temporary base where we can go rock crushing and mining and I don't know, maybe set up like a little mining camp maybe. To have its like own power generation on oxygen and water. We've got like a workshop there. Um like some accommodation for us. That would be cool. That's all it would be. what we'll do is we'll pull around first things first we're going to fill us up first and then we're going to connect up everything else right, so right, I should be good there right helmet on let's go fill up our water and oxygen and then we'll, uh, we'll go from there I think open the door uh, another thing I'll do quickly is I'll just turn off this interface. We're not really needing it right now, so we will turn it off. Right, so I'm thinking let's fill our water up first. Do we need to fill up this water bottle? Eh, we do a little bit. We'll fill it. Suit power, 50%. We also need to charge up our suit as well. Um, we'll do our O2 as well while we're here. Here we go. We're good on O2 for now. Right, okay. So, uh, what we'll do is we'll fill the rover up with, um, with oxygen first. This should fill relatively quickly. It's mainly charging the damn thing, which is going to take the longest. Um, our oxygen should just go ding. Hopefully. I'm hoping that we have enough oxygen, but... Down like 33. Might need to connect the other tank now. I go, I think we're full. I think. I'll just connect up to the other tank just to make sure we haven't got any left. Why we need a sword and need a pump, but I don't really want to waste the resources on a pump. If we don't have to. I think that's more or less full. Right, let's um right, we'll connect up the power at least. Um I'm going to I want to put a temporary transformer. Uh, no, I'm not. Right, let's hit number four. Grab power cable. I'm just going to use its own power cable. Right, that's the one that goes to the rover. What we're going to do is I'm just going to knock it up to, up to that. Uh, there should now be filling the rover up. Uh, how full is this anyway? Um, pretty full. It shouldn't take too long to charge up the rover now. And what we'll do is before we leave, we'll just top up on our um, oxygen and everything. It is charging. It's at 46%. It shouldn't take too long, really. 
And when we head home, we're going to try and keep it as low as possible as well. Um, we might go do some mining in it, maybe. Um, just sort of, like, decrease the amount of, um... The amount of power we have in it. Yeah, the power is going down relatively quickly. So it should only take about an hour to charge it, I'm hoping. What are we on? 55%. Not doing bad. Right, while we wait for that, what we'll do is we'll just check everything in here. Actually, you know what? I'm actually going to go do what I wanted to do. While that charges, we'll go do this in here. So we'll split the stacks and we'll just keep on putting one in. I just want to really fill up the... Um... The whole thing. Just so we've got everything we need. Just makes transferring everything in here a little bit easier. All I have to do is shift click and it'll all go into like nice even rows and I can see how much of what we've got. If I need to build anything extra, I always can. Try and keep that my current inventory empty. When we're grinding stuff down, we've got plenty of room for everything else. Uh, I've already got 26 glass plates, but uh, 26 glass plates I might increase. This is what I want to do in the other container what's at home. I might end up replacing that container what's at home with this one. Then this one be our bulk storage. Maybe, I don't know. It does make it easier to see how much gear we have. Which, I don't think this is everything. I think there's still some stuff at home which we've uh, we've left. But this gives us a good understanding of what we've got while we're out here. Plus our resources at home were starting to... Starting to get low. Because we've... Uh, we haven't been out here in a while. Yeah, if you have a look as well, we've got like plenty of space below the, all of this stuff just for um like for other things if we need them like uh, like circuit boards. If we fill up uh, everything in our main or, uh, in the main area where we set the uh cockpit. There we go. Couldn't remember the name of it there for a second. If we fill all that up we'll um we'll just start moving stuff out here. It's fine. Got loads of electronics now though. Obviously I'll get more as we mine and grind stuff down but there we go. Yeah so we've got like two extra rows there for whatever else. We're gonna probably fill up most of this stuff, so let's just call. Um, I will just call it container for now. I'll come up with an awesome name. That, or actually, you guys can name the uh, the containers. You guys can come up with cool names. Like, think of something. <laughs> right, we are at ninety nine percent, so we're almost there. Um, that battery shouldn't be that much empty. Obviously, it's getting power as well as we're doing this, so uh, it, it's it's. It got down a bit, but it, it's not really a lot, though, really, is it? Seriously? Am I seriously that low? No, I'm not. I'm not even... Right, we're at 100% charge. Right, okay. Uh, we need 15 going back to that, so what we'll do is we'll just knock this down to uh, 16. Uh, we'll disconnect our rover up that and we'll nicely just plug you back in and we're now making oxygen and water again just like that easy peasy and before we go what we'll do is we'll switch these tanks back over we'll fill them up just to get that little bit this is me just being overly wanting to make sure everything's fully filled right Okay, let's head on out. We are fully charged, fully ready to go. So let's um let's close up. Oxygen source external. 
Uh, we'll put our cables back up there. We'll take our helmet back off because we don't... Oh, we didn't actually charge up our suit, did we? We'll put this helmet back on. We'll head back outside. We'll charge up our suit. Um, I completely forgot about the suit. We can just pull it off the battery, though. Pull it straight out of power stock. We could really pull it from the um, rover, but... I know it's only minute amount of power from the rover, but I just rather put it from this battery. Pulling it from the battery is just a little bit easier. Because this battery's only just going to fill up again anyway, so. Right. Let's go now, shall we? Now we'll actually head on out. We're now fully good to go. Uh, we'll also hit the inventory one last time for, um, for where we're going. We'll mark it up. So we've been here and here. We've also been there. I think we head up over this way. Maybe set up this place, this place. And then maybe come back and hit up these two. And then come back this way. So we do like sort of like a loop. I think is a good idea. Let's do it. Yeah, but yeah, for the, like the next couple of weeks as well, just so you guys know, it's going to be mostly, mostly just coming out here exploring like this. So if you guys are into this, great. If not, then I do apologize. We'll be back home. Um, probably... We'll be back home soon. Uh, like, like right now, as I'm recording this, it's when... Well, it's currently Saturday, but when you guys are seeing this, it's going to be Saturday. Uh, sorry. Wednesday. My bad. Um, we are only... We are less than a week and a half until the exploration update. There's quite a lot of good stuff in it. Um, everything I'm seeing currently from the devs seems really good. I can't wait until that update comes out. I can't wait at all. Make sure all the lights are off. As soon as um, this update comes out, it's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to be building a lot of stuff. We're going to be upgrading a lot of stuff. Um, so we might need some abandoned tablets, which we've got plenty of. Um, hopefully, they don't make me um, start a new save. Hopefully. Like, we've got so much done in this save. I'm hoping that we can keep it. And then just expand on this, which I'm, I'm probably guessing they will do, but... We'll get there eventually. We're not that far off the update now. Um, weeks are disappearing right now. Like the like when they first announced it, it was a couple of weeks ago. Um, was it a couple of weeks ago? Or was it a week ago? I don't really remember. All, all of them are blurring into one. We got that. I've got that much um, happening in the next. Oh, beginning end of this month, beginning of September. Um, we've got like a new game releasing in early September, which I'm really excited for. Excited to play. Um, end of the show is going to be busy, uh, especially on my channel. So if you guys want to stick around, see what I get up to, please do stick around. Hit that subscribe button. Hopefully you'll be excited on everything what's coming up. Like we're going to be playing Starfield soon. I know Starfield's a different type of game from Occupy Mars. It's a, still a space game, but hopefully you guys will stick around for maybe for that. This game is not going anywhere though, and I don't really want to fall off the edge of the cliff. Let's go third person just so I can see what is happening. Head down here a bit. I think I might be able to get down there. Wow, this is a fairly big burst. Yeah, I should be able to get down here alright. Bit rough, but I think I can do it. Maybe it's not. Oh no. We're stuck. This is one thing I didn't want to happen. If we get stuck, we are stuck, stuck. Oh no, this is not good. Yeah, we are stuck, stuck. And I don't think there's anything to do where we can get unstuck either. Yeah, this is not good because um, 
my last save is beginning of the day. Right, can we do anything to get unstuck? No. Well, I think we are completely stuck, so I need to actually be more careful about this. I knew this was going to get me stuck, and I should have listened to myself, but um, hey-ho. Right, what can I do? Can I actually... can't, like, reset it or anything, can I? Can I maybe use the, the crane to get me unstuck? Let's give it a go. I don't really think so, but... I was thinking maybe just plunk it into the ground, maybe. Might help. Nope. Yeah, we are completely stuck. Right, what I'm going to do is, um, since it's been about 30 minutes, we're going to have to actually restart this entire day. Um, so what I'll do is I'm going to reload the save, uh, head home, and then head back. Actually, no, I don't need to do a lot of stuff. I can... Um, we saved an uh, autosave, didn't we? So what I'll do is I'll relaunch the autosave and I will see you guys uh, in a few minutes when we get back over here. So I'll see you guys in a few seconds. Alrighty, what's going on guys? We're back. Um, it's been... It's been about half hour, <laughs> actually. It, it literally, I had to reload the game twice. Um, the game, when I reloaded, um, I got back to camp, I recharged this thing back up and it actually killed me. Yay. So I had to reload. Uh, we're back again for the second time. Uh, this is the first time I've been back over here, though. Uh, we're fully charged. I've also just realized I've still got my helmet on. Um, so I'm going to have a little bit of extra oxygen. We're going to go around the left side this time. Looks like the left side going around is actually the better way. Um, I think as well, if I actually hit that thing with enough speed, I think I would have actually made it. Um, but yeah, this looks like a better way in than the previous way. Also, sometimes just keep the speed up might help. Um, yeah, I can make it down there. Let's go. There we go. <laughs> See, sometimes with this thing, you just gotta keep the speed up. Which is fun. Right, okay, we're here. Anyway. Uh, I think we'll park... Yeah, here we'll do. Right, let's head out and let's go explore. Uh, first things first, let's um, turn uh, this setting back on, just so I can see everything. We're also just looking for stuff under the ground as well, when we go inside. Bit darker inside, so we can actually see what's going on. Oh, it's one of these. There we go. All right, we're in. It doesn't look like there's much below the ground, which is good. Usually, once we uh, load out of a chunk, come back in, we usually lose a lot of stuff. Um, I'm gonna scrap most of this if we can. I've also organised the. Um, back of the um, container as well. Everything will be in a slightly different order because we actually did most of that before I had to reload because we got stuck. Hopefully I'm not stuck in this crater. If I am and I have to reload and I've scrapped all of this, I'm going to be very, very unhappy. <laughs> Might be a thing we have to do from time to time is actually um, probably leave the rover up top and then come down ourselves and Grab what we need. These are, this stuff is easy to mine anyway. How easy to grind down. Grabbing it. It's extra plates, extra stuff. It's less stuff we have to get in the long run. Less stuff I have to uh, create myself. Better. Less, less crafting I have to do. It's good. 
we've got some like organic fertilizer. I'm just gonna take all of the easy things we can grab. Grab all of this easy stuff. If I can take down the majority of this stuff, I'm just gonna grab the easy. Can I grind these down? Yes, I can. So, I'm pressing the wrong button. Not good when V and C is right next to each other. I need to change that. We're getting like loads of packs of screws and stuff like that. The screws are good. We've got loads of them, but I think it's also small pipes we've got loads of as well. V and C is so close together. Okay, that's the majority of this mined out. Looks like that's on the other side of the wall. Up this way. We also haven't got the um, the tablet from here yet. I'm hoping to try and get maybe two of these done today. Potentially two done tomorrow. Right, okay, there's nothing on this catwalk. You just look back. Yeah, nothing on the catwalk. Another room like this, right? Okay, we'll take down the walls and everything as well. Get pipes from this. Steel plates. Both are good. Not gonna fully take out the base though. I want to, but I don't want to at the same time. If I need to, I can always do it. Do it later though. The only real reason I would do it is to get the uh, the concrete, but right now, to be fair, we've got plenty of crafting materials at home to craft the concrete. I think it's I mean, what concrete exactly takes. We're gonna leave those. I'm not gonna fuck around with them. Tricky to get. Get everything what's fairly big. Go outside and get the solar panels too. Ah, oh, there's the tablet there. Alright, I'm just going to leave the majority of this. Grab this, we'll grab this because it takes like literal two seconds. First aid kit, grab, grab the tablet. Uh, we'll grab this line here, then we'll go outside and grab the rest of the stuff. The only reason I'm doing this is just so it's easier for me to see what I've, uh, see if I've missed anything. Clear up some of the clutter. If we can do this base in the next base, today and tomorrow, um, and then head north again, and sort of come back on ourselves, head up, uh, hit up with the fob again, spend a little bit of the day there, grab whatever else we need, and then leave. And head, head back out exploring again. Like that, there should be more than enough for us. I think there's a rock out here potentially. There we go. Right, okay. Cool, we've got stuff out here. We've got some panels and stuff we can grab. Uh, I think let's grab these first. Meg kit and some rocket fuel. Grab all these. Take down this. One button again. I don't think there's anything in this one. Pretty sure everything pops out. The 
rock. This is a circuit board in here. Medium circuit board, nice. I think there's another one over here somewhere, wasn't there? Grab all of these. Oh, you are oh, just food. Good. We can always do with more food rations. I think I'll be able to get the rover out of that hill back there, if in doubt. I think these solar panels are bigger than the ones I've currently got. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they are. Can't wait to get these bad boys. Pretty sure they are bigger than the ones we've got at home, right? Guessing you've got small, medium, and then big. Currently on medium. Could rip out all of our medium ones, put these large ones in. Ooh. Cranking in the power. Absolutely swimming in it. Starting to get a bit hungry as well, but we should be good. Wait until uh, the game tells us that we're hungry. Uh, I've got many more of these to go. Another six to go. Seven, including the one that's next to us now. And we'll see if we can get the hell out of here. Grab the post as well, may as well. We can mine up all of this place today. Um, maybe do a bit of traveling overnight and then tomorrow morning we get to our destination. Should be good. I'm not going too far as well, which is nice. I've got to say like getting around like these little areas here where we are now would be great for like, um, like a road, uh, not for the rover, but for like, um, dirt bike or, or something else which is a little bit easier to get around with but when we're doing stuff like this we really need the rover we really really need it no way we're doing half of the stuff what we're currently doing without this rover Two more to go and then we're done here. Then we can get the hell out of here. Head to the next place. Which I'm excited for, to be fair. Hopefully you guys are too. Hopefully you're enjoying these um these episodes. Uh they do take a lot. Sometimes. What's that there? Something in there I've missed picking up. Go check to see what it is. Small circuit board. There you go. See? But you always double check before you leave. Make sure you've got everything. I could have very, very easily missed out there on a small circuit board. Did construct most of this tunnel and give me loads of glass plates, like, but I'm not really. I'm not hurting for glass plates. If in doubt, I can make some. But yeah, it looks like we've got everything from in here. Right, let's head to our next location. Let's mark this as Bean, and then we'll uh, head there next. There we go. There's our local carbohydrates. We'll need some food once we get inside. Um, we really need to empty our inventory as well. Actually, we'll do that first before we uh, we set off. I was going to set off, but we'll uh, we'll dump what we can in here. As you guys can see, everything's a little bit different in here now. Uh, let's 
screws can go, they can go, they can go, they can go. Uh, solar panels can go. Uh, the rest comes in the cab with us. Alright, let's uh, close up. Take our helmet off. There we go, we can take our helmet off. We'll just uh, plunk these in there as well. Stop wasting oxygen on our suit. Right, so we've got another abandoned tablet. We've got some more rocket fuel. Uh, we don't have silicon up here though. Um, I guess I need to make a splice for that, eh? Uh, what we'll do is move that down there. We'll put the silicon up there. Calcium, we already don't have a spot for either. Um, guess what we'll do is we'll start putting make it rocket fuel down here. Uh, we don't have anything for those yet, so they can stay. They can go in there. Small, medium. Right, there we go. Right, um, map. Let's uh, pop up our map and we'll head to our next location. So, what we'll do is we'll do that in there. Right, where are we going next? We are heading this way. So, I'm guessing maybe it's down here and then up there. Let's just see if there's anything else we can see on the map which we can mark. Now, what I'm going to do though is I'm just going to re grab this. I've spotted one here, look. We can grab. Uh, potentially. Uh, there and there. I've also seen one down here, look. There's a couple here we can probably get as well. But I'm thinking what we do is maybe just come back over this way. So we'll probably head up this way. And we'll come up here and we'll hit the, these ones up. But we're going to stick on our main track, but we're, on. we're going to head up around this way and come back this way. Head back down towards our fob. Right, uh, we're marked. Uh, let's put on the front lights so we can see what we're doing. And let's hopefully get the hell out of here. Yeah, I think I can get up there. No issue. I hope we can anyway, otherwise we're a little bit screwed. Usually they tend to have a, a, a way of getting out of situations like that. Or this, I should really say. Uh, yeah, we can, we can make it all over there. Uh, I think we can hit a hard right uh, round. Whoa, okay. That was grim drop. Uh, right now, chunks are loading. So we're... Um, there we go, we're good. We're heading to where we need to go. Right, so we're heading to the right here. Yeah, this looks like a fairly flat land here as well, which is nice. But it's sort of heading back towards home a little bit. We're quite far out, to be honest. Right, let's just stop. Okay, we're good. I think we actually transitioned between, like, two chunks right there. Which is why our frames dropped dramatically. Right, and there they go again. That we're good. Right, I see the base. I just don't see a good way of getting to it yet, unless... I don't know, we can go down here by the looks of it. Yeah, it's just a fairly smooth drop right here. Here we are, we're at our next base. We're going to be going over and scrapping and everything. Right, I think what we'll do... Um. We'll exit here, we'll uh, we'll turn off our lights. Don't need those on anymore, so it saves a little bit of power. All right. We'll sleep, we'll wake up, and then we'll uh, we'll get on. So let's sleep until uh, you don't have enough water. Great. We do, but you can't be in the game. 
Right, uh, 6.30, I would say, is about right. For sleep. Somebody also did say sleep at night and then... Sorry, sleep during the day and then drive at night. External pressure dropping. But, um, yeah, we're... We, we drove a bit of the night. Uh, not all night, though. It's also hard for you guys to see as well. Um... I know my videos are a little bit lighter than I would uh, I would think they would be on YouTube at the minute, but that's because I'm doing some crazy color correction for this game. Let's switch those out. Fortunately, you have to do a bunch of like for whatever reason, this game's a bit washed out for me. Um, I've seen other people's videos and it's not as washed out as mine is, but it's still a bit washed out. Right, let's just see if there's anything underground. We're again lucky this week for things not being underground. Which is nice. Nice change. I grab the abandoned tablet. This is just going to be one of those bases where I think we're just going to loot mostly and then just leave it. Might go hit up a couple of other places. I can't get through here. Why I always take out this corner is so I can get around. Why I'm grinding them out as well, right? There we go. Don't think there's anything in here, but I'll grind it just in case. Right next, it takes two seconds to do. Continue through here. Small rock. Screws. There's a circuit board there. Nothing else here. Am I stuck on? Looks like that takes out the structure. Can't get to that circuit board. But enough is it. To be honest with you, I didn't read if it was medium, small, or what. Not these, they're always good to have. There we go. Yeah, I can grab it now. Small circuit board, I'll take it. Now, one thing we haven't got a lot of is large circuit boards yet. don't have a lot of those I'm just gonna take out these cabinets just sometimes to hide stuff it's easier to take them out and then see what's inside than it is anything else anything drops to the floor we'll grab nope nothing fine right, I think that is everything then I don't see anything else. We'll just take these out. We got these big tanks. I think if we look straight down as well, we should be able to hit up this. A crouch, maybe? Yeah. Allows us to see a bit more of what's going on. Oh, well, there goes that. <laughs> While I'm on, I might as well just take out the rest. We'll have a look at the map where we're going next after this as well and we should hopefully manage to get out of here. Not too much trouble. Grab these solar panels as well. Okay. 
Ah, sandstorm I can deal with. We can be outside in the sandstorm. It's the um, one with the dust devil. That's it. I need to be worried about sandstorm. We can remain outside. I don't need to worry about that too much. not going to take the whole base, I'm only going to take as much as I can, or as much as I want really. Right, let's walk around it while wow, we've got no sandstorm, we've got six hours until light comes, anyway. I'll take this. I'm not sure if we can hook up to these, but I'm not really too fussed. Um, yeah, the majority of this is all gone anyway. Right, I'm going to leave that the way it is. I'm pretty happy that there's nothing below the ground. I'm just going to stand in here and have a look. Just to see if I can see anything. don't think I can, though. No, I'm not seeing anything on the ground. Right, okay, I'm happy. Right, let's leave. On to the next one. That one was fairly easy, to be honest. Right, let's empty our inventory and then we'll go. Right, so if they don't go, they go, they go, they go, they go, they go. That can go, that can go, that can go. Time to fill it up. What it's there for. Right, the rest of this here can go in here. Uh, what circle about are you? You're a small. Trying to run out of spaces. Oh, there's a small circle about down there as well. Right, I think what we'll do then is I'm just going to move all the mediums down. That means second row of medium. Uh, aluminium can go in there, that can go in there, and the tablet can go in there. Right, I'm quite happy with that. Let's close on up, let's take our helmet off and we'll, uh, we'll continue. Uh, helmet's off. Right, what we'll do is we'll zoom in here and we'll, um, we'll mark this as B and G because I've been and grinded down most of it. B and G, been and grinded. Uh, right, where are we going from here? Uh, we are looping back this way, so I'm thinking we head out here, out here and head up this way, I think. If I have to stop here and climb up, I will. Alright, so let's track red. So, where are we going here? We're heading out back the way we came, turn right, and then just follow it around a bit. Should be able to turn fairly tight. Right, reverse. We can do it. Yeah, we should be able to get around there fine. We're back out the way we came. Maybe we'll head up over this way. And then hang a right. And that should lead us more or less straight there, I think. So I can get a bird's eye view so we can see what we're doing. Uh, I'm also trying to check to make sure I'm not going to get stuck on anything. Uh, I think maybe it's going up over here. Might be a good decision. And then probably down there and then up to the right, I'm thinking, yeah. External pressure dropping. External pressure can drop all at once. We're good. I think we've got plenty of water as well for, for a little while. I guess as well if we have to, we've got med kits. We'd use some of those. So I think all we do is when we get really thirsty, we just um, we drain health. Which if I have to, I can stop and take med kits constantly. 
we got like enough med kits to last us a few days. Right, so I need to figure out how to get over here. Only 500 meters away, but I just need to make sure we get a safe way of getting there without getting stuck. We haven't saved in a little while. I think going down here might be a wise decision though. Looks fairly flat. Yeah, I think we can just drop down here. And down to the right and then more or less straight there. I haven't had another one about this sandstorm yet. It's been a few minutes though. Let's just let's just slam on the brakes and stop for a second while uh, while the game catches up. We're good. You just see like the like the, the amount of power on the uh, or the amount of load on the GPU just drop because the frames drop dramatically. But yeah, I've got like another on my second window I can uh, I can see what's going on. It's just to check. Um, I'm curious to what happens on my machine when that happens. Oh wow, this is just a dome and not a lot here. It's all right. Right, let's um, pop our helmet back on. We'll head outside and we'll uh, we'll continue. Getting a good second day out of this, I do believe. We're doing quite a lot in one day. Just uh, start tearing things down and we'll start looting and... Um, within the next three hours. There we go. So yeah, we've got like three hours to, until it comes in. Might even be moving on to the next location by then. I think in Sandstormers as well, like the, the new wind turbines and everything, they actually produce us uh, some nice stuff. Circuit board there. Why well, you were small? Nice. I'll take it. Alright, we'll uh, grab all these solar panels while we're here. We may as well. Just some extra solar cells and everything. As long as it's not a dust devil what comes in, we should be okay. I'm pretty sure we've had one sandstorm before and it was fine. We're good on water. I'm trying to conserve the other one because uh, we're probably not going to be heading back in the next day. I need to keep that last one as full as I possibly can. This one as drained as I can. So right now we can't sleep. Oh, we can sleep. I want at least one extra day out of the um, our current reserves. Another thing I realised I didn't put on the rover is helmet repair kits. Um, I actually like the um. When I had to reload the game, I think it was this episode. Um, I ended up smashing the helmet. Nick then killed me. Um, and I went to the rover just to see if I had any helmet repair kits. Don't have any helmet repair kits. Not good. That's one thing I need to put in the everyday carry for the rover. There's helmet repair kits. At least, at least some. Like I, I don't need that many, really. But I'd rather have them than not have them. Which, right now, we don't have them. Which, uh, if anything happens... We are screwed. Well, we think we've got a spare helmet, but I don't really want to take it out of its, uh, out of its place because I can't replace it again. It's like, it's like one of those like if, if I need it, it's there. It's in case of emergencies. But just judging on um, what they're bringing into the game as well, like where you can like carry and pick up things and place things into things. I'm hoping that you can actually start placing things in the rovers properly. Judging by by, by the sneak peeks the, the devs keep on dropping, definitely looks like yeah, you're going to be able to I think. Which means replacing 
like the oxygen canisters and everything inside the rover would be great. We can get more oxygen tanks and everything. Place them in there, then I don't have to carry them on me, and then I've got more room to do like this type of stuff. Also, when we get back, um, probably the end of this week, I think we'll be heading back, maybe. Hopefully. I'm hoping for maybe it's a Friday return. We'll see. We'll, um, we'll prep for, um, or get prep again, head on out, and then uh, probably come back with hopefully enough uh, like materials and everything to. Uh, Sandstorm, anyway. Any minute now. I'll look into the second board. Nice. Got some cement. I think we're going to be leaving here relatively soon, anyway. By the time the sandstorm comes in, I think we will be, we'll be leaving. Yeah, like I think you can like build like these things and actually place stuff in them. Or something similar, anyway. I'm excited for the update, though. Really excited. I've never been so excited about an update for a while. There's the tablet there as well. Grab the tablet. Grab these boxes. Why not? Yeah, we're good on we're good on hydration for a little while longer. Right, I am done here. I think that's everything mined. So, there's nothing this side, nothing this side. We'll go this way around the building though. Yeah, there's nothing. Right, we are pretty much done here. Right, we'll, uh, we'll head up the next base. I'll just offload everything in here first. Uh, so, more of those, 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 more of those. More of those. We're good. Right, the rest can go in our cab with us. Right, lock up. Right, we'll uh, take this off. We're good on water for a little while longer. We're starting to really fill up as well, which is nice. Uh, sandstorm is now imminent. What circuit board? And then tablet. They can all get added to our stuff. And look, we can't see a damn thing. <laughs> right, well, I guess what we'll do is we'll try and head up to the next place, which is not too far away. It's only on top of the hill. We've got a little bit of time left in today as well. So, right, what we'll do is we'll put on beef bean. And uh, what we'll do is we'll mark up the next place, which is over here. Not exactly sure on how we're going to get to it, though. Um, let's have a look in the radar here quickly. So, I'm thinking we can up here and the Moby's up around that way. And when we come back, we're probably going to head down this way. Right, we'll give it a go. See what we can see. If absolutely anything. Yeah, next to nothing. So, this is going to be fun, right? I think what we're going to do then is let's turn on some headlights. We can attempt to see where we're going. Yeah, I can't barely see anything. If I can't see anything. I don't think you guys can see much either. This is terrible. Especially when I can't see anything. I need to be able to see so I can navigate. I don't really want to go any further just because I, I can't see diddly squat. Right, let's not get stuck. Let's not do that. Right, I think 
let's just stop here. I'm quite safe here, I think, for, for a few minutes. Right, let's um, go back inside. Let's uh, turn off the lights. Um, I think what we do is we sort of just hang out in here for a little bit. Um, what's the repair? Uh, does this need repairing a bit? No, not really. We're good. That's good, at least. We can use our beds. Um, let's see how many of these we've got. So, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, so we've got 15 small circuit boards. We've got uh, 4 medium, which is alright. We need to repair one, though, which is not too bad. The small ones are great. We've got 7 more tablets. We've got some cement, which is nice. Got a few of the little bits and pieces, which we're just carrying. Um, if we keep on going with how many circuit boards we're getting, we're not going to have much space for much else, really. Uh, we're going to start to fill up quite rapidly. Um, it's good that we've got this many circuit boards, though, because uh, we're going to need them. And uh, we've got at least one for one more base. Um, well, we've got more for multiple bases, so whatever, we've, whatever we're going to miss out on on the base we've just made, we've already gained back massively. Which is nice. Now all we need to do is wait for the sunstorm to... Oh, it's gone. All right. All right, let's... Um... Oh, now I see what I was trying to climb. I think I got maybe up over onto the top there. <laughs> I couldn't see a damn thing. But uh, I'm thinking we might be able to go down this hill here maybe. And hit it up. Maybe, if it's not too... It's steep. Now oh, we can make it down there. We can make it down there, no issue at all. Wow, the windows need cleaning after that sandstorm. But yeah, we. I think we can even make it back up there if we wanted to as well. Alright, I'm quite happy that we made it. Alright, we are starting to run low on water we're not all the way down but we are just about there i think we just started to take damage there as well because we're now completely out of water yeah we are we're out of water all right we're on our last water reserve so we can sleep one more night before we gotta go home Right, I think what we'll do is we'll loot this place up and then we'll uh, be close to ending the episode, I think. I'll wait for this um, music to chill out. There we go. Speak of the music. Don't think we're going to make it back to, um, to our fob today, but that's alright. We're, we're doing fairly well with what we've got. I think... Um, Definitely in the next um, next episode, I'm well, not next episode, but like the next few videos, we're going to make a second rover and grab the water bottles out of it. Who knows, I might end up making a couple of rovers. And then just, you know, using them as um, ways of getting Water bottles, really. That's all we need. We need oxygen and water bottles. They're like our main... Like our main... Like, sort of, need. We're in desperate need of them. Yeah, we're good. Nothing in here? No? No. Is it a medium dome? I think this is a medium, I think. Curious. Oh, look, medium circuit board. Just casually on top of everything. Alright, we'll, uh, we'll hit up this room. Some electronics here.
from that. That's actually something below the ground. Yeah. We'll reload for that. Unless if it's not below the ground, it might be outside. We'll have a look. Oxygen, 75%. Another small circuit board, which is nice. Nice to have. Another small circuit board, nice. It's starting to get dark. Let's head outside and just see if this is outside or is it underground. Nope, it's outside. Alright then. I think it's just food anyway. Yeah, I'm alright. We haven't actually cleaned out the inside yet. We'll uh, try and get as much as we can done. I'm also trying to keep an eye on the length of the episode. It's starting to get a little long. I've been recording for almost uh, an entire hour more than I normally do. I guess what we'll do is we'll grab these and then what we'll do we'll finish off probably tomorrow with this we'll loot and then we'll grind down the rest of it as long as i know i've got all the loot i'm fairly happy up oh, there's the tablet just scrap these just just to see if they've got anything in them so I don't keep on reopening them all the time. All engine. Every little helps. Like literally. Can't grind those down. What is that? Oh, it's one of those bin things. Uh, a couple of things in this dome. Too great. It's just a couple of packs of foods. Just live a little bit longer. Right. I think we go maybe grind some stuff. I think we've looted everything we can from this place. We've got loads of circuit boards from it. Just lovely. Canister. Right. I think we maybe head outside, do a little bit more grinding just for a few more minutes, and then we'll uh, we'll call it there. I think we'll uh, we'll start over here and grind most of these solar panels down. Wow, superpower is not really draining that much at all, is it? Yeah, these piles are not going to take too long. I love how fast this thing grinds down. Can't wait until this thing's like a durability. I hope that. One thing I'd sort of do hope is because the super power right now is a little bit overpowered. I hope that um, when you're grinding stuff down and stuff, it actually sort of uses your super power a bit more. Which could be one of the reasons why the, the new heavy suit has, um, has multiple batteries. You can have up to like three batteries on it, I do believe. Could be why... We have three batteries, is, um, the, these things have durability, uh, which means we're going to have to repair them over time, and hopefully it maybe uses some super power to grind with. Who knows? Good idea. That's my theory anyway, it's what I want to see. Because super batteries right now are a little bit underutilized, and especially if you're going to increase how many you can have would make sense. We're on Sol 99. In a few minutes, we're going to be on Sol 100. Which means we've survived on Mars for 100 days. 100 days.
which is, to be honest with you, a hell of a long time. To be honest with you, I might actually be able to finish off all these panels and everything today. If I can, I will. Lead into a little bit of tomorrow, but we should be alright. Before I get done now, the better. We can only sleep probably once more, and then we're completely out of water. Yeah, I can grab the last of these panels today. Grab the last of these. There we go. Sol 100. We have survived to 100 days on Mars. Like, yeah, we've died and had to reload a few times, but... 100 days worth of survival is nothing to laugh at other than the couple of incidents we've had we've done fairly well there we go this should be the last solar panels hopefully um, if I haven't missed anything else we'll uh, we'll walk around the base again once tomorrow just to make sure we've got everything but um, yeah that's going to be it for today um, hopefully everybody is enjoying the series and everything. I'm actually really, really enjoying playing this game. Um, hopefully it comes across in the videos that uh, I actually do enjoy playing this. Um, I guess what we'll do is we'll, um, we'll empty out our inventory um, just so we're not carrying a bunch of stuff on us which we don't need to carry. And um, yeah, that's 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 about it for today. Let's um, let's close up shop. We'll, um, we'll take our helmet off because uh, we don't need to wear it. Um, we've got plenty of oxygen inside. Um, we'll load up everything else out of our inventory. And um, that's going to be it for today. We've actually got a bunch of stuff done, where, which is really nice. Uh, let me just move these over. Um, got that there. So we've got more small circuit boards. We've got a medium. We've got another small and another small. We've got loads of small Sega boards. I'm actually really glad on that. But uh, yeah, I'm actually going to go ahead and end this one right here, guys. Uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying the series as much as I am. If you guys are, please do hit the like button if you aren't. There's always that dislike button right next door. Subscribe if you guys haven't already. Other than that, I'm going to go ahead and end this one right here. Thank you guys again so much for watching. And I will see you guys all in the next one.